Hello, Ukulele Underground, and welcome to Songs Made Easy on Ukulele Underground, where we take songs that we've taught here at Ukulele Underground and we simplify them so that it's more beginner friendly, so that anybody can approach these songs and learn them. All right. So even though you're picking up the ukulele for the first time, you're able to kind of you know pick up a few pointers. But in today's um, songs made easy. We are going to be doing a jam. So what we do here at Songs Made Easy is we learn these easy songs and at the end of the month, like today, the last Thursday, we do a kind of a recap of what we've done throughout the month. All right. So we've, uh, we have these songs. We have Just The Way You Are. We have Breakdown. We have Aloha Oi. So we got a great lineup of songs that we're going to be jamming tonight. Okay. And then, um, if we if we get done with those three songs, we have some time. Let's look over some of the stuff that we've gone uh, that we've gone through in the past. All right, so here we go. Let's not waste any more time. Let's get down to business. Let's play our first song, "Just the Way You Are." Let's warm up with this uh, this classic by Bruno Mars. And here are your chords. So I'm gonna show you how to play these chords, and I'm gonna show you the strumming pattern we're gonna be using. So first off is a C major chord, ring finger, A string, third fret. If you would like to watch the individual lessons for these, we do have them archived on our YouTube channel, so make sure to check those out. Or if you'd like to check out ukuleleunderground.com where we have all of our videos, please check that out as well. So I like to use my ring finger to just kind of keep things organized because for the A minor, I'm going to be using my middle finger to go up in the G string 2nd fret. And on the, uh, the F chord, I'm going to be using my pointer finger here. So if I use my ring finger there, it kind of organizes everything so that when I change my chords, uh, they are in a better position. Okay, so ring finger, A string, third fret. Um, I like to kind of keep a good, um, you know, a good point of contact with my instrument. My thumb is over here, so with my ring finger and my thumb there, I can use my pointer finger here as well to kind of support the chord. And this is our C major chord. Next up we have an A minor chord. So because I have that point of contact, I can release the C chord and still have a good grip on my ukulele using that pointer finger knuckle on the underside of the neck and my thumb at the top like this. Middle finger goes up, G string, second fret. Next up we have an F chord, uh, pointer finger, Goes in the E string first fret, and let's keep that middle finger on the G string second fret, like so. All right. So, um, and the next chord we have is we just go back to C. So C, A minor, F, and C. All right. So those are our chords. Strumming pattern we're going to use is a simple down strum. So we like to take things a little bit easy here with Sounds Made Easy. Two, three, four. So we're going to do two bars each, which means uh, two four beat strums. So one bar gets four beats. So two bars means eight beats. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, A minor. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight to the F. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight to the C. Five, six. And we're going to repeat the whole thing. So C again. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and A minor. So, with that said, those are going to be the chords and strumming pattern for this song, Just The Way You Are by Bruno Mars. So sing along with me, play along, and um, you know, if you get mixed up with the chord, don't worry about it, just pick up on the next chord. So if you mess up, it's all good, just keep going. As long as you're having fun, that's what this is all about, right? Here we go. One, two, ready, C. Oh, her eyes, your eyes make the stars love. 
look like they're not shining. Her hair, her hair falls perfectly without her trying. She's so beautiful, and I tell her every day. Beat. Yeah, I know, I know, when I compliment her, she won't believe me. And it's so, it's so sad to think that she don't see what I see. But every time she asks me, do I look okay? I say, when I see your face, there's not a thing that I would change, cause you're amazing, just the way you are, and when you smile, Just the way you are Yeah Her lips, her lips I could kiss them all day if she let me Her laugh, her laugh She hates but I think that it's so sexy She's so beautiful And I tell her every day If perfect's what you're searching for, then just stay the same. So don't even bother asking if you look okay. I say, when I see your face, there's not a thing that I would change. Girl, you're amazing. Just the way you are And when you smile The whole world stops and stares for a while Girl, you're amazing Just the way you are Just the way you are And when I see your face There's not a thing that I would change Cause girl you're amazing Here we go Just the way you So nice and simple. That's how we like to keep things here on Songs Made Easy. If you like this type of uh, play along, make sure you tune in to uh, Lower Friday Live Jams where it's not so easy. We teach you this, the chords and we teach you the strumming patterns and uh, we do picking patterns in there as well. So if you feel like this is a little bit too easy, tomorrow at the Lower Friday Live Jams, we have the jam for you. But for all of you beginners out there, I hope you guys are enjoying yourselves. Let's uh, move on to our next song. It's going to be Breakdown by Jack Johnson. Here are your chords. So they're going to be a bunch of chords here. So our first chord is a C chord. So a um, ring finger A string, third fret once again. Okay. For this one, we like to use our E minor. Pointer finger is going to go down like this, and it's going to be our new anchor. Middle finger. E string 3rd fret, ring finger C string 4th fret. And then A minor, 
Middle finger G string 2nd fret. And then we're going to play a G chord. So we're going to take that middle finger, place it down on the A string 2nd fret, point of finger C string 2nd fret, ring finger E string 3rd fret. And here's the kick to that. If you don't make that uh, middle finger on the A string 2nd fret, and you play it without it, it still sounds like a nice chord. So you can play the full G if you want, or you can just play your pointer finger, C string, 2nd fret, ring finger, E string, 3rd fret. Totally all good. Because that's actually the chord that they use for the, uh, for the song. It's the chord that Jack Johnson uses. So you can play full G if you want, or without that middle finger there. Okay, so we have C, once again. Ring finger, E minor, A minor, to G. I think when you taught it to, you mm -hmm. taught the C with the pointer finger. Mm -hmm. so you oh, can and then you just went back. Mm, nice, nice. So pointer finger, uh, like what Kahai was saying. A string, third fret. You can just slide it down and form that E minor there. And then uh, you can just go up. So middle finger goes down one fret, goes up two strings. And then that same middle finger goes down A string, second fret. You build your G chord around it. Right? That I think that's how we taught it. Okay, good. <laughs> I'm just so used to my ring finger using it on the C chord and then A minor and then G. So for the bridge, um, I think uh, we can use a middle finger for C for the bridge. So that would be your C chord. So your G chord would just be sliding your middle finger back and then building your G chord around it. Corner finger C string second, ring finger E string third. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna switch these two fingers pointer and middle finger so that your middle finger goes back up to the G string 2nd fret pointer finger goes on the E string 1st fret so like this okay so from the C to E minor to A minor to G and then the bridge is dun, 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 dun. <laughs> People are used to using their uh, ring finger though for that C. They can, right? Yeah, yeah totally, totally, totally. Okay, so here we go. So C, E minor, A minor, G. So it goes one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two with down strum. So every two down strums, we're gonna switch chords. as best as you can. If you get lost, don't worry, just catch up on the next chord. I hope this old train breaks down and I can take a walk around and see what there is to see. Time is just a melody with all the people in the street. Walk as fast as the speed can take them. I just roll through town. And though my windows got a few frame I'm looking through seems to have no concern for now so for now I I need this whole train to break down oh please just let me please break down Screams out loud, centipedes gonna crawl westbound, and so I don't even make a sound, cause it's gonna sting me when I leave this town. And all the people in the street that I'll never get to meet if these tracks don't bend somehow. And I got no time that I got to get to where I don't need to be, so I. I need this old train to break down Oh please just let 
me please break down I need this old train to break down Oh please just let me please break down to the bridge I wanna break on down G and F one strong I wanna break on down But I can't stop now Last time Let me break on down To the E minor And then to the third verse, here we go But you can't stop nothing If you got no control Of the thoughts in your mind That you kept in you know You don't know nothing But you don't need to know The wisdoms in the trees that glass windows can't stop wishing if you don't let go of the things that you find and you lose and you know you keep on rolling put the moment on hold the frames too bright so put the blinds down low i need this whole train to break down oh please just let me please break down I need this old train to break down Oh please just let me please break down ba ba da ba da 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 ba da ba ba da ba da 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 ba da ba ba da all right, nice and simple. If you want to learn the full um, breakdown for the song Breakdown, uh, check out ukuleleunderground.com. That is ukuleleunderground.com so that you guys can check out our website and we can, uh, we can teach you a thing or two about the ukulele. That's the site right there. Ukuleleunderground.com. We have full songs. We have lessons. We have all kinds of stuff. You want one-on-one -on -one coaching? You want private lessons? Um, sign up for UU Plus while you're there at Ukulele Underground to take your ukulele playing to the next level. If you like these songs that we are showing you right now and you want to download them as a PDF, make sure you sign up to the news uh, for the newsletter uh, in the link below, right? Yep. The link below, you can sign up for the newsletter. And the newsletter will give you these new sheets every week so that you can kind of look ahead to see what we're going to be teaching that week. And um, you can make a, make, a little, uh, make a little book full of songs here on Songs Made Easy. And uh, it'll feel just like an ukulele club. So, uh, let's see. Let's play... Our last uh, song that we worked on this month. So this is, here are the chords right here. This is a song called Aloha Oe. It's written by Queen Liliuo Kalani here in Hawaii. And this is um, it's one of those songs, it's like a goodbye song. You know, like farewell to thee, right? Is what it, is what it means. So, Aloha Oe, farewell to thee. So here are your chords. First off, you have a G chord, point of finger, C string, second fret, ring finger, E string, third fret, middle finger, A string, second fret. Next up, we have a C chord, ring finger, A string, third fret. Next up, we have a D7 chord, point of finger, G string, second fret, middle finger, E string, second fret. Which transitions nicely back to our G chord. Because it's just the two fingers, um, two out of the three fingers that we use for the G chord, corner and middle finger. On the G and E strings, all you have to do is just switch it down one string like this. So it's on the C and A strings instead. The ring finger goes in the E string third fret. Back to the G. We have one last chord. It's a G7. Middle finger. C string, 2nd fret, point of finger, E string, 1st fret, ring finger, A string, 2nd fret. So if you're still a little bit confused, we do have the diagrams in front of you on this side of your screen. So check that out. Or you can check out the full lesson for a complete breakdown of these chords and how to switch from one chord to the other. Alright, so um, for this we're doing down strums once again. So it's just a nice simple down strum. So the, uh, the chords are going to be a little bit tricky, so I'll go over it with you right now. So it's G, 1, 2, 3, then to C, 2, 
three and then two bars in G. And then D7 for four bars. We go to G7 to the chorus, or we just stay in G if we want to go back to the verse or end the song. Okay, so here we go. Follow along as best as you can. And if you miss a chord, don't worry about it. Catch it on the next bar. So we uh, some of these chords are two bars long. So if you didn't get the G chord that first bar, get it on the next bar or get it on the next chord. Okay, just try your best. And that's all we ask for. Sometimes you know some people get songs like really quick. I know we did this last week, so. You had one week to kind of rehearse it a little bit to play it for today. And if you still can't get it, don't worry about it. Keep working at it. It's a great song. It's a great song to kind of, you know, learn some uh, some good chord switching in there. I know we explained last week and, um, you know, how to efficiently switch from one chord to the other. Okay, so here we go. Let's stick to G really quick. Do ready and to the G. Maybe let's go to D7, kind of our vamp, D7, just to get ready. Back to G. Back to D7 again. <laughs> there we go. Start. And 
napahai kali ko puahi lehua o ka Song called Aloha Oi, written by the Queen herself, Queen Liliuo Kalani. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, let's see, can we do one more maybe? Let's see if we can uh, we can squeeze in one more song. Kahai, what's the song that you want to hear? What do you want to hear, buddy? I think uh, was it like uh, a couple months ago or mm. like one of the months we didn't get to do the jam, right? Mm. So we didn't get to do ah. all the songs. Mm. I think one of the songs that we didn't get to play was "Come and Get Your Love." Okay. Okay, yeah. let's check it out. Oh, I haven't done it in forever. Let's see if I can remember. <laughs> and I remember not doing that one so well. So let's see. Here are your chords. Okay, so first off, we have a D minor chord. Middle finger G string, second fret. Ring finger C string, second fret. Pointer finger E string, first fret. So those two fingers are going to be bunching up. What you can do is kind of switch your wrist or twist. Or sorry, swing your wrist. That's what the word I was looking for. <laughs> swing your wrist closer to the... Um, to your headstock, and by swinging your wrist, it kind of creates a little bit more room to play that G D minor chord. Next up, a G7, you take those two fingers that you just did. Middle finger goes down one string, uh, still on the same fret, second fret. Uh, ring finger goes on the A string, second fret, for your G7. And next up is a C chord. Just slide over that ring finger to the third fret for the C chord. A minor we played before, G string, second fret. And from there, you can kind of use it as an anchor to get back to your D minor. So it goes like this. It's just two strums each. Let's see if I can, I can do it. I have, I have traumatic uh, stress because of uh, the last time I tried to sing this song. That's it. Here we go. Hey, hey, what's the matter with your hair? Oh, yeah. Hey, what's the matter with your mind and your sign? Baby, cause you're mine and you're fine and you're 
look so divine and come and get your love come and get your Casimero it? <laughs> nah, 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 just joking. Come and get your love. Casimero chicken? <laughs> you gotta start it though. Come and get your love. Hey, hey, what's the matter with you? Feel right? Don't you feel right, baby? so much for tuning in to uh, Songs Made Easy. We're going to have a new batch of Songs Made Easy songs for you folks next week. So um, check in on that. But actually, um, I think the... Uh, are we going to be here for that Thursday? You think for the August 10, 11? Oh, um, yeah. I think we leave on a Thursday. So. Yeah, so we might not be here yeah. for the second Thursday of uh, of the month. So, But we'll, we'll let you know next week because next week is the first Thursday and we'll let you know if we're going to be here or not but we are very excited we're we're super stoked to be doing this um songs made easy for you folks we yes. actually have a lot of fun uh while while doing this What's that? i think there's five thursdays okay. in august so oh, even snap. if we miss one we should still have three, three songs so at least and three then songs. Jam. oh good 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 perfect so you know just like how we did today well we'll, we'll play those three songs during the jam and stuff and maybe we'll revisit one of the songs one or two songs who knows it depends how much time we have so um once again thank you so much for supporting ukulele underground and watching songs made easy if you want to learn how to play this awesome little instrument head over to ukuleleunderground.com ukuleleunderground.com here is the website for more songs and lessons, check out ukuleleunderground.com. While you're there, sign up for UU Plus to take your ukulele playing 
to the next level. Somebody asked if the newsletter gets sent out in advance of the lesson. Yes. And that's like the idea that yeah, you get yeah, the, so you get it before then. The printout mm-hmm. before. Yeah. Yeah. So the newsletter, if you sign up a newsletter, you get these printouts before then and um you know, so you can kind of look over it before I, the before the lesson starts. I think the link is the same though. So you mm-hmm. can periodically like check back with mm-hmm. the link to mm-hmm. see if it updated with the new songs. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's it. Okay, so yeah, that's, um, that is Songs Made Easy. If you want to learn these songs, head over to ukuleontheground.com. We have the full tutorials. We have the, you know, the strumming pattern thing. Come and get your love has a, has a nice chunk of them. So if you want to learn them in their original key, if this feels like it was a little bit too easy for you, check out the full lesson over at ukuleontheground.com. We'll see you folks next time. Have a great one. And for you folks who are signed up for U+, stick around for one-on-one coaching. Go to your dashboard and click on the banner for one-on-one coaching. This is Aldrin Guerrero. I'll see you next time. Aloha.